Hi, it's Chris Crocker in the Four News Now First Alert Weather Center, helping to plan your Friday and your weekend. Let's start off with your Friday planner. It is going to be a cool start to the day with temperatures in the 40s and 50s, but then we warm up into the mid 80s. 75 is our average high. Expect blue skies and sunshine. Let's track our weather pattern. We have a ridge of high pressure over the region that is going to stay with us through Friday into Saturday and then we will start to see some changes. A dry cold front will be tracking over the region on Sunday and that's going to bring some challenges. It's going to start dropping our temperatures. Here's a look at our four-day temperature trend. You'll see we peak on uh, Saturday at 87 degrees and then a little bit cooler Sunday with that dry cold fronts approach and then down to 76 on Monday. The cooler air may be welcome, but gusty winds, not so much. Here's a look at our wind gusts as we take a look at our weekend weather. Um, relatively calm on Friday and Saturday, but then we start to bring in gusty winds late on Sunday and into Monday. And we are still in the uh, fire season, so with a very dry week, that warm weather this weekend, we are fairly concerned about the potential uh, for wildfire risk. Here's a look at a map that shows our wildfire risk for Sunday. And we are in the moderate range. That's from the National Interagency Coordination Center for Wildfire. Uh, so stay tuned for the potential of uh, some red flag warnings or other uh, concerns about wildfire on Sunday. Overnight lows tonight will be down, or rather on temperatures on Friday morning will be in the 40s and 50s around the region. Our Friday high temperatures in the 80s for just about everyone. We are going to make it into the 90s in Lewiston, 90 in Wenatchee, and 83 in Coeur d'Alene. Here is a look at your planning forecast. We're up to 87 Saturday with sunshine. Then the clouds come in Sunday afternoon. Winds picking up as well. This is a dry cold front, so uh, no rain associated with it. We do have a slight chance of showers on Wednesday. Thanks for watching and stay tuned. I will have a detailed look at the Spokane and Coeur d'Alene forecast next.